Hey guys, what's up? And welcome to another episode of Bruin Build. Today we are back in the town of Moor working on some cleanup stuff. Have not really done anything at all around here beyond uh, what we did last episode. And uh, probably not going to do uh, too much in this episode. I do have one plan that I think is going to be good. Um, and that is to build some barges. What do you have to trade? Uh, nothing. That's so ridiculous. Like, why? I don't know. But I, I'm thinking what we're going to do today is I would like to build a couple barges. And I think one's going to go right here. Nice big one. And we're going to go, I think since this is already pretty much oop, air conditioner. OK, there we go. So what I'm thinking is that we're going to take this and I know that's already there, but let's grab some oak. Probably going to have to grab a little bit more. Grab some oak and put another pillar right here just to come on. There we go. Just to bring that up here. That goes to right there and then this it goes in by one so this is one two three four and then we want one two three four to get rid of you grab you and break that and go like that right like that now it's even on either side and i think that helps uh, my sanity just a little bit but what we're going to do is build some barges, and I think we're going to focus on this big one first. Um, and then off camera, I'm going to continue building a few more. Um, I've forgot I made these actually pretty wide. Um, they are, let's see, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight blocks to work with. That's a pretty good sized area to work with. So I'm, I'm glad that we had the... Uh, forethought to actually do that and I believe each one is probably eight I would imagine so I'm gonna probably put a barge or two in each one of these that one I may do like more of a canoe or something I'm not sure but we're gonna focus on a bigger type barge over here today and then uh, I'll try and build those at the end um, so that you have something to look at and oh I definitely want to grab these because they are a little difficult to come by so let me sleep and uh, I'll lay out just like the beginning floor plan and we'll jump right on into building. All right, I have a little bit of a uh, sort of thingy made here, a dinghy made, if you will. Um, and this is looking pretty good, I think. It's uh, pretty big. And I'm looking at an image of kind of a, uh, it's like, it looks almost like a two flat like a flatbed barge but with two type of like pontoon canoe type things on the side to hold it up so we've got some weird water glitches going on um but that's the idea is that this is kind of imagine it's hollow i suppose and filled with air i'm not sure imagine it's more of a pontoon type of thingy um this is about the the best i can do with the shape and the size of it um, but I think it's, it's going to look good. Now these are going to be sales. And so what I'm thinking is to bring these up pretty decently high, maybe right around there. I think that could be good. Let's see what this looks like. I think that would be good. We'll have that go all the way up there like that. And actually let's see here. What? walls do we have wall hmm not nearly as many as I was hoping for well that's okay because I was gonna say a wall would look probably better than having giant beams like these um how tall does this go this goes to there boom right like that well that's okay we'll figure out a topper for that um, but so it's going to have two sort of sails, if you will, right here on the, more of the back end. And then the front is going to have some like netting and stuff for say fish and things like that. And then along the sides is where the main storage is. Um, and so to do that, 
I want to put up kind of a, I guess it's the, this is like a, a guardrail, um, but I want it to be kind of a guardrail. And then this is going to be trap doors. I want this to be kind of a, a, a extended bridge thing that is very temporary, not anything that they are going to be like, it's just for loading and unloading things, I guess. Uh, nothing too crazy, um, just to be able to get things on and off. Nothing, nothing particularly insane, but we'll have this here and go like that and then like that. So we'll have that. And then I actually kind of like that having it go was it one, two and then break, break, then one, two, three, break, break. I kind of like that. I like it breaks it up, makes it <laughs> breaks it. It breaks it up makes it a little interesting. Um, now let's see here. And since this is going to be a barge, it's going to need, maybe, maybe we make a rudder. Would it need a rudder? I don't, I don't really know if it would need a rudder. Maybe let's add one. Let's, 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 let's add one. I don't know. <laughs> I probably should have thought through how to do this. Um, so this is the center. So maybe we put a little beamy thing here and then a rudder kind of sticks out funkaliciously. Um, that mm, mm, could be kind of a ruddery type thingamajig. Maybe what we do is instead of a, that, we could do that. Does that kind of look like a rudder? I mean, from this angle, it does. From this angle, it doesn't look too bad. Um, no, <laughs> that's not that's not good. Uh, let's see. I, I like that. I wish you could get this type of stair, you know, somewhere somewhere else. Ooh, ooh. let's grab some jungle trap door and real quickly throw it down like that. I think that looks like a pretty decent rudder for just being like quickly thrown together. Um, let's add maybe a stair here for the steering portion of it, I guess. Um, and then I guess they would have to hold on to it somehow. Let me sleep. Maybe this could be how they hold on to it. Let's do a jungle one though, so it all blends together. I think a gate is going to look pretty decent for to fit that uh, rockets. No, um, dark oaks, you can go. Oh, we have so many. I didn't actually need to really care that much about them. Um, what do we need? Oh, yes. Let's do this and then do the jungle variant right like that. Very good. Cool. So we're going to add this guy right here. And then let's actually, maybe we just get rid of this all together. Maybe there's only one sale. Um, that might work. That could potentially work. Let's take a look at what it looks like and see if it looks weird just having one sale. Ah, it kind of does. I feel like it would look strange. So what we can do is move that to there and move you to there. So essentially, we'll just kind of fake it, I guess. Uh, and let's bring it down by one. I think that would be good, too. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Very good. All right. I think that'll be good. That'll help um, clear it up so it still gets to keep the two sales looking things. I'm not sure how I'm going to do that, though, because there's going to be it's going to be like furled up and we don't really have any sort of like sail texture, maybe diorite. Maybe we could use diorite. I don't know. Um, but anyways, what I do want to do next is to take some. What am I looking for here? Some of this stuff, crates and barrels and maybe a furnace or two, a couple chests, and um, that'd probably do it. Maybe we'll do this, grab one of these, 
And do we have any? I was wondering if we had any charcoal or anything like coal. And I'm not thinking that we're going to have anything in here. <gasps> we have one. Ooh. Oh, we have plenty. Wow. that We have a, a, a lot more than I thought we would. Um, so we can actually use this to make us a nice little doohickey uh, campfire. That's what I want. Uh, let's make... Uh, I guess we can't make one more. Uh, we go like this, and now we can. Boom. There we go. The reason I want a campfire is I... Well, I don't really know. I feel like these, there should be some sort of, um, you know, I don't know. I just like the smoke effect. I think that's why. But let's start laying these guys out. So we're going to get all these things right here, right here, and there. And that'll be good. So this will connect. So I don't really like that. Does that connect? Gosh darn it. Well, that's okay. That is fine. Um, we can put up maybe trap doors or something. Something to like kind of hold these together. Ooh, rails. We could get some rails that like hold on to stuff. That could be really cool. Uh, let's put a smoker there. Maybe put a chest. Uh, my inventory is starting to implode on itself, but that's okay. Maybe we put a chest like that, and then we put a double chest there. And then perhaps this is going to be like fishing stuff. So maybe what we do is on this side, we have some more fencing that goes. Um, oh, how would this do it? How, 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 how should we do it like this? Maybe we do three on this side. And then we go like that. And then we can maybe do some sort of fish netting or something like that. Maybe actually let's get rid of let's do this instead. I have an idea. I'm going to have to go get cobwebs, but I have an idea. What I'm thinking is we're going to make the fish net right along here. And uh, I think that'll look better. So we'll go like this. And Maybe we'll just have it draped down like so, so that it'll hang off of this and then it'll look like we have fish caught all in this. I think it's going to look good. I have to get the materials for it, though, so I, I don't know. Bear with me on that. Uh, stay tuned to figure out if this actually works or looks any decent. Um, let's do the this like that and then a barrel there let's put smoker down there maybe a chest here a uh, chest here um here here and then let's put you there and let's do one more thing composter i forgot we had these um Let's put a composter like that and then a composter right here. And then maybe what we do is we make kind of a, a fake barrel that is purely to hide a light source in. I think that would be good. And ooh, what's, what would happen if we did that? Oh, uh, that looks kind of funny. I don't mind it, but kind of looks funny. So we won't do that. All right. Sorry about that. I uh, randomly got talking and then had no idea what I was going to say. But so is the life of me right now. My brain just goes all over the place. Um, I crafted up. Actually, I forgot I had a crafting recipe for um, cobwebs. It's just a string here 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 in the middle one so it's like a plus shape and then you can get this here um cobweb and i think that's pretty good i think that's pretty fairly balanced it's not too uh crazy and overall i'm pretty i, I think it's pretty 
pretty dang balanced. It's not like crazy or anything like that. Um, I guess we're going to go there and there for now. I'll craft up a few more. Um, I did get some looms for this area. I thought the looms could look pretty decent around here. Uh, let's put a loom here. Might as well. Um, one thing I did want to do is... Gosh, we don't have any rails here. I may have to go fly all the way over to the other area. Our... Um, What's that place called that we're working on currently? Brassington. Brassington, that's what we're working on. Jeez. Um, I may have to run over there real quick to grab a few materials since most all of my shulker boxes are still over there. Um, so let me actually go ahead and go ahead and do that because I think I might want to grab some diorite and stuff too. And I don't think we have that much. So let me go and grab a few more materials and then I'll be back and we can finish this here barge off. All right, so I've been doing some work, actually decided to get rid of the whole sale idea. And uh, yeah, I've done a bit of work, um, put some more netting in, put some fishies that have gotten caught and kind of finished the decor up. And I think the final touch that I'd like to do is to put down sort of these oars. And so I'm going to put these here. And basically what they're supposed to be is maybe we put them, should we put them on both sides? Maybe we put them in the center. And the idea is that these are pretty big. And since this is pretty shallow, I'm guessing this, is, this would actually like stick up a good amount. Uh, let's do one more. Let's see. Let's see how far down this has to go here. So if we put it dead center, right like that, it has to go one, two, three, four, five, six to get to the bottom. So let's do this one, two. And what we're gonna do is actually make this kind of like a paddle. I kind of want that to be kind of similar to how like a paddle looks. Um, it's kind of weird though, because of all this stupidness, all this uh, one one thirteen water, like all this water is from like one twelve, and so it I don't think it updated to one thirteen exactly. Um, so it doesn't like water logging. Doesn't treat these all as sources. I don't think. Uh, okay, good. I was afraid that was going to be uh, not effective or, or whatever. Ooh, there we go. And there. So what does this look like? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I'm going to have to figure out how to do this as a paddle. Um, maybe if we took stairs and made that very, very first one instead of a trap door, we make this a stair so it connects. What if we did that? How does that look? That, mm, I think that could, in my mind, could pass as a paddle. I think it could pass. We're going to say it's going to, we're going to pass. So let's see, this has one, two, three, four, five to break up even right there. Um, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And let's make it go up by, let's do another one, two. So this one is nine tall. And since this one is going to be shorter, this is going to have that there and that there. And let's fix this water real quick. OK, I guess that's not going to fix it. Great. Just strip that. Gosh darn it. Okay, so this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one more. And we're not going to be able to get right like this. And then can we do it? We may have to do some finagling here. And boom. There we go. So now they're equal height. 
And the reason I want to make sure that they're equal height is because, yeah, I mean, it's a little realistic. It adds a little realism. So the paddle is kind of leaning against the boat. And because it's shallower over here, it's going to be taller. And uh, it might seem silly, but I think it's uh, it adds just a little bit of realism. So the idea is these are kind of um, both paddles slash they push with them. Um, kind of like a gondola is kind of how I'm thinking this would kind of float along because this is not like a crazy ocean or anything like that. It's just this like swampy river that they're going to be traveling across. So it's not anything crazy. So there's one barge done and I'd like to do maybe two more smaller ones. And I think that will make this area seem pretty nice. So let me go ahead and work a bit more, build up maybe two more, and I'll be back to hopefully have something fun to show you. So I'll be back in just a little bit. All right, guys. I have built three more boats. One I absolutely love. The other two are okay. They're not bad. Um, trying to build barges is kind of strange. Also, of course, we start recording and it is uh, basically evening, but that's OK. So let's let's go down here and I think I'm in the wrong shaders. Let's see. Let's go to Sildur is a medium. Yeah, this is the one we messed with. So what I have done is. Well, this is the one we showed before. Don't think I made any changes to it. All right, well, he's fine. He'll despawn. Um, let's actually sleep. Can we sleep yet? Well, hold on. Let me sleep. All right. So the other two or three that I have built um, are we'll go from uh, smallest to largest. So <clears throat> these two over here are the smallest, these little guys. And basically all I've done is built these small kind of like small fisherman barges where they don't have much in the ways of um, what we have two. You can have two spawn at the same time. What? That's weird. I guess I'll go. Oh, he's probably tra trapped in the. Yeah. Whenever they get trapped in the cobwebs, they uh, kind of freak out. And ooh, I missed that view. Like, that's just amazing right there. Ooh, baby. Um, what I've done is made this kind of like a small fisherman barge. And I, I really do like it. So each barge has a little bed. Um, the only one that has a covered bed is actually that one. That one's pretty nice, nice and ritzy. Um, and there's a fishing net on these small ones on either side to hold uh, various fishies. And what I've done is use scaffolding kind of as a, a almost like a netting. I don't know how to explain it more like maybe a wire, um, a wire sort of um, walkway sort of thing. So it's a very light boat. Um, and the idea is I'm going to change the texture of the scaffolding a bit to be a bit darker, a bit grungier, probably matching our swamp green, that green right there, Sw matching that just a little bit more um, to also go along with the green from the bamboo. And I don't want it to be too I don't want it to be too bright, but I also don't want it to be like wooden if that makes sense so i'm gonna try and find an in-between of this and that to try and try and figure it out not sure this is going to remain um some sort of netting probably just a darker version of this color right here i think that'll be good but these boats are the same these little barge babies barge babies <laughs> baby barges are the same um i tried to variate the uh lantern sides they need some sort of lighting i thought so that's kind of the what i came up with this one is by far my favorite you know this one was decent and it definitely has the most fish in terms of the net this is by like the biggest fisherman type one type of barge but this one 
this one is the idea I had that I was thinking of for this one. Like that was this is what was in my head. I just didn't think of it very well in this. So this one's OK, not bad, but this one is by far and away my favorite one. And so you can come on here. It's decently spacious. It's one, two, three, four across. So decently spacious. You obviously have this guy, but you have a covering. And I thought this was so handy. What do you have to trade? Pumpkin brown dye. I do kind of need brown dye. Mm, but I'm going to pass. Um, dude. Dude. Whatever. So the bed's here. And this is what made... The bed is what... This is the, the first one after, I guess, that one that I thought, you know, we should put covers over them because no one's going to want to sleep in the rain. Um, so I, I put a cover over this and I got to say, I think it is the best one by far. Um, I got a, I got, got a, what is this, a smoker packaged up a little bit. That's supposed to be kind of like it's a packaged up a little a little bit and then i uh, got a fisher area here it's a little different um it's supposed to be kind of like it's attached to these um but we're gonna keep those there so people don't walk around on them i've already had two traders um that have climbed around here and they're a bit annoying but this is our dock area all finished and i like what it looks like i really do I really do like finally having some life in this dock area. And the next step uh, in between episodes, what I'm going to do is I would like to build one out in the middle right there, maybe just a little out there. And then I would like to make to next episode continue working here. I know we're doing a lot of more town of more stuff, but I'm really really enjoying kind of working with these colors again um it's just a nice break from the uh city of brassington such vibrant orange um it's just a nice break getting back down into the dirty like mossiness of everything here and so we're definitely going to be back in the city of brassington but since we're kind of having to take a break from it right now for video sake um i thought that it'd be fun to focus in on this a bit so I'm going to probably make a few small ones, uh, maybe one right there and one right there. And then next episode, we're going to do some landscaping down below and maybe do some landscaping on the river area to we had already started to. But I want to deepen it all around here. And then if I can get a good view of it, I want to deepen it a decent amount here. And then we could do some of that. You know, with our new coarse dirt texture, that looks really nice. Yeah, I like it. Um, but I think we're just going to deepen it here and kind of make it lead out a ways to like this area. And then this can be like the main channel area that they follow. And then that's really all we have to really do. Uh, we don't have to do anything too crazy after that. So that's I'm thinking what we're going to do next episode. Um, and then I think... Yeah, I, I really, I'm really trying to take these one episode at a time. I'm not really sure what else we're going to do, but really enjoying this. So if you guys liked it as well and you like these boat designs, they're a little different. I couldn't really find any Minecraft barges that are kind of like this. So uh, if you like this uh, design and stuff, there's definitely going to be a few more built here. Um, and uh, yeah, if you liked it, leave a like in real life. If you're new here, feel free to subscribe. Join the little family we've got going here. And uh, one one thing I wanted to say is we are coming up on a thousand subs um, actually pretty quickly. I'm surprised. Like I've been ga gaining subs even while not making videos. Um, and so I'm, I'm honestly surprised that I'm still gaining some subs. So I wanted to throw this out there now. What do you guys want to do? for 1k special sort of thing um it probably will have to be after emma and i get married and the honeymoon and the moving and all that stuff um but what would you like to do i would like to toss that out there for you right now so you guys have a little bit of time to chew on it a bit um so that is all i wanted to say and uh, for any of you who are wondering where comment question of the day is that is going to probably just continue after um, 
everything else as well. I'm kind of really anything that is a little bit more effort in videos, I'm just trying to put off. Um, so yeah, sorry about that. Sorry if the quality drops and all that stuff, but hopefully you still like it. Hopefully you're liking everything and I'm going to stop blabbing. So if you liked it, leave a like in real life. If you're new here and you like everything, feel free to subscribe, join the little family we've got going here, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.